quite a bit of damage in Citrus County with a lot of power failures. So we don't want to see that happen Sorry. even after it passes Tampa Bay because that can still cause Sorry. some problems. But here's what we have for Citrus and Fernando. 75 to 90 mile per hour winds, 6 to 10 inches of rain, the surge 3 to 6 feet, higher in citrus, kind of tucked up in there up towards Cedar Key. Uh, Pasco County, 80 to 95 mile per hour winds possible, tornado threat will be around and very heavy rain, we've already seen that. In Polk County, the high winds, rain 6 to 15 inches, could be some flooding and could be some tornadoes. We've already seen a few tornado warnings, but nothing confirmed. Manatee County, winds 90 to 110, tornado threats. Rain 6 to 12 inches, storm surge 3 to 7 feet, worst condition Sunday night into Monday. Pinellas County, this is where we're so vulnerable to storm surge. Coming up around the bay, that wouldn't happen until late in the event after midnight tonight, early in the morning. We'll go back to a west wind. And for Hillsborough County, again, a risk of tornadoes, high winds, and storm surge possible coming in right, late we'll on Sunday later. night, early Monday morning, and so those high times we'll have to monitor very carefully. Here's a seven-day forecast, by the way. We just updated this, and it looks pretty good after we get rid of the uh, really stormy weather tomorrow morning, and then after that, Tuesday, Wednesday look really nice. Maybe some scattered showers or thunderstorms next week, but it's going to get hot again, Alan, up to near 90, and unfortunately, I, a lot of people won't have power. That's the problem. I mean, that is going to be really gross out there. If we hit 90, and we will, and we have the high humidity and all the water lying around, and then people are out of power without air conditioning, uh, you talk about something wearing you out. It's miserable, and then there, at night you're going around with flashlights day after night or night after day. I mean, it's going to be long. So uh, we're going around. I remember in uh, Wilma in 2005 in South Florida. Wilma came along late in the season in October. Oh, right. oh, yeah. And I remember they were saying the power outages were so bad because the cold came down after Wilma.